What is going on guys? Welcome to Gregel's TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Let's get into the news. The first story of the day is the Galaxy S8, S8 Plus, and Note 8. The latest information and rumors coming out from Sam Mobile is that those phones will be most likely getting the Samsung One UI Android Pie beta fairly soon. And what they're saying is that uh, the phones, if they do get this, the Note 8 will probably get it first just based off of uh, the latest story we had yesterday where the Note 8 got pushed up a month uh, saying that they'll officially get the software in uh, February of 2019. And now if the beta comes out, most likely that'll obviously come out before that and comes out. And then the Galaxy S8, S8 Plus is rumored to officially get it in March of 2019. But the, again, the betas are always gonna come out first. So this is great news for people that have those devices. Um, you're looking at America being one of the top uh, places to get it first along with Germany, South Korea, India, and the UK. Now, once this does officially come out, I will definitely cover it and I'll definitely let you guys know. But in the meantime, make sure you do all your updates for like the Samsung members app if you have that, depending upon where you live, or the Samsung Plus app. Again, depending upon where you live, do, do the updates from the Google Play Store or the Galaxy Store. And again, just follow the channel. I will definitely let you know when it officially comes up with the rumors and, the, and what it looks like is it looks like it's gonna be coming out fairly soon. Next up, if you're on Sprint, you have the S8, S8 Plus. They've just pushed out the December update. So check your phones right now and basically just go into settings, software updates, and check for the update. And if you have it, download it, install it, restart your phone, and you'll be all up to date with the latest bug fixes and security updates. And the last story of the day, guys, is it looks like we have an official caught in the wild Galaxy S10 photo. Now, Evan Blast put out a tweet saying Galaxy S10 Beyond One in the wild. And from what we've been hearing about these new Galaxy S10 phones is, the, the screens won't be as rounded or curved, whatever you want to call it, as previous generations. And it's kind of been like that the last few years. If you remember like the Galaxy, I believe it was S6 or S7, they were like super curved and like a little bit too sharp on the edges. And they've kind of gotten a little bit better over the years. And it looks like they're going to continue that trend with the Galaxy S10. And again, this phone right here, since it's the regular S10, it's going to be 6.1 inches. And you can see the slight curve on the sides. Also in the top right, you can see the camera cutout, no notch or anything like that, just a camera cutout in the top right. And then very small bezels at the top and at the bottom. Um, you should still be getting stereo speakers because there's gonna be a speaker at the very top bezel in the black part and then probably at the bottom of the phone as well. And you're looking again at the Galaxy S10, supposedly in the wild. Um, just looking at the sides, it's tough to see, at least from my angle in this photo, any buttons on the left side. I can't remember if they put the buttons on the right or left, but regardless, you don't see anything really on the left. No, the buttons were staying on the left, so I, I don't personally see the buttons, so maybe this is not completely real, or maybe it's blurred out a little bit, or maybe I'm just not looking at it right. But regardless, this is supposed to be the Galaxy S10 in the wild. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. My question out to you guys is, are you getting more excited about the Galaxy S10? Or are you like, nah, not really. I'm gonna wait for the Note 10 or some other phone. Let me know in the comments down below what you're most excited about. Uh, for me, I'm just getting my hands on, on it at this point. You know, it's a futuristic device with a futuristic look, and I'm excited about the cameras and the screen, and that's what I'm most excited about. Thanks for watching. We'll see you down the road. Peace.